Hey, what's up guys? Um, back with another video. Today is going to be something different. Um, I've never done before. So, this is going to be a guy talk. Or well, girls are coming to it too, this too as well. But, you know, what I'm going to say is something that I've been dealing with for a while now. And we've all dealt with it. This is no motivation. This is no inspiration. This is just guy talk. Okay, just guy talk, girl Guy talk, the girls come and look and listen, but whatever. But just this is about um, what's that word? Shit. It's something that's really important and it's something that we've always been dealing with. It's called self doubt. I have doubt, doubt myself for a very long time. Uh, I know we all have to. Um, I've been dealing with self-doubt for about since I left high school. Okay, because you know I wasn't really after high school I wasn't really that confident in myself as much. Um, <clears throat> you know I've been. It's just really hard to to just think about what's important. It's really hard to just think about. You know what to do in life but you know us people you know we've dealt with this a lot and it really at the end of the day you know self-doubt it's like something that would just slow you down and you know not let you go nowhere and you gotta do a lot of thinking like so many times in your head like what what to do what not to do and just what will people think of me, or, you know, what, what will people say? And we will have those things in our minds. And we'll have those things, you know, just basically everywhere. Um, I've, sometimes I would doubt myself a lot. Because, you know, during high school, when I went to high school, when I went to high school, I just, you know... I thought myself basketball wasn't for me anymore because you know a lot of people doubted me. A lot of people say I sucked at it. A lot of people say that you know I'm not good enough. I really doubted myself a lot. Even though I said sometimes, but I really mean a lot. And when I look back to it and how much I have like grown out of it. No, I didn't technically grown out of it, but it still bothers me. It still bothers me. And, you know, it really could, re it could really mess with your mind. Because, you know, we would be that type of person where we just want to, you know, go somewhere in second, like a little corner and just shrug our shoulders or just sit down and just try to think like, like, why is this happening to me? And why is it like, Just, just why, you know? It's like it's like that one question, why? Why me? Why, like I said, why is this happening to me? Why is it just doing this or doing that? It's, it's a lot to think, a lot to like, it's just a lot. Now, you know, us guys, we all have, us guys have self-doubt. I know the girls do too. But us guys, you know, we have, you know, certain feelings and we have certain, like, things that we don't, like, want to talk about. Um, we're also, like, what's that word, man? The, the girls always use all the time. Um, I forgot that damn word. God damn it. It's so... Hey, hey. You know, even me talking about it, I can't even think of all the damn words that I just could write. <clears throat> but, um, you know, every, you know, us guys, we, we try our best to do things right in life. And we try our best to, you know, just do our thing. Do our, do our thing and just keep on moving forward, but... 
you know, we have to learn that doubting ourselves is not going to be fit for us. You know, certain people have certain abilities that, you know, they'll not have their, the, the, the doubt in their lives and just forget about it and then they'll just want to just go. But certain people like me and all the people out there, and, or maybe just you guys watching the video, uh, we'll be always be thinking about it. Doubting ourselves because you know we think that we're not the best. We think that we're not capable of any of anything. Um, we just think about so many things that that probably ruin us or destroy us. You know, like for instance, I play basketball and. And every time I go to the park, I'll be seeing a lot of people, and I'll always see a lot. Look, I'll always see and look around me like there's a lot of talent on every everywhere I go. Even though I work so 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 much harder than them, I feel like it's not enough. I feel like it's like not good enough. Even if like some some guy or some kid. Just plays for fun, but you know they know what to do. And certain times when I want, you know, when I want to practice or whatever, I always see guys come to the park with a ball, and they'll see one lonely guy on one lonely court, and they'll just want to stare and just just look at you and be like, "Oh, this guy sucks." In their minds, they'll just think that. And I'll be thinking about that sometimes because I'll be looking at them. And they'd be looking at me, and I wouldn't be, like, I'd be, like, always messing up my training because of that. It's happened to me so many times, and every time when I see a lot of people come and they want to play ball, I just, I get nervous, and then I'd be, like, thinking, like, what are they thinking in their heads when they see me out there just doing my thing? And... I'd be like thinking so hard, like, are they talking about me or are they thinking about what I'm thinking of? Like thinking like, oh, this person sucks, this person can't shoot, he's not capable of anything, he can't do this, he can't do that. He can't play ball right, he can't shoot, you know, just a lot of stuff that just goes through my mind and my heart will be racing and racing. And it's just something that's been bothering me for a long time. And I just, I just haven't really gotten through it yet. Like, when I'm by myself training, I'll feel comfortable. And if I only see like one or two people or three and they try to actually want to play a game, I'll, I'll obviously get used to it and join them. But when there's a lot of people and there's a lot of like dudes that just they, you know they play on teams and they know what they're doing. They shoot good. I'm always thinking like this is making me look stupid. Like I don't think working hard is not enough if I can't do a lot. If I can't do better than them. But I did make a promise to myself that I was gonna beat everybody. And let me show, let me show you something. I wear this every time when I train, even though it's from a video game, you know, basketball, 2K. It's, to me, it's like motivation. This is what it says. You guys can see. You just put it like this. No. Why is it upside down? I don't know if you guys see it. I feel like it's upside down. Well, if you guys see it correctly, it says they will know your name. And I wear this every single day because I want people to remember me and remember how much hard work I've done. But the only thing that's stopping me is self-doubt. I don't wear this for like a symbol. I wear this for a reason and for a purpose. 
because I want people to know who I am. But just doubting myself is just if anyone will not, if no one can know who I am, I gotta stop doubting myself. Like for instance, you know, you guys that's watching this video, or girls that's watching this video, if you guys got some type of, you know, um, dream, some type of way that you want to do things, you, you think that you're not capable, um, you think that you're not the right fit, it's not too hard to try. People would think so many times, they would think about just telling you to stop, but you know, you don't want to. And to be honest, it's not people that's stopping you, it's you're stopping yourself. You're battling yourself. You're battling the inner you. I'll be doing that too. I'm battling my inner self. But the thing is, I'm battling two battles. My inner self and people. We've all dealt with this. It's just all about letting it go. <clears throat> we gotta let it go at the end of the day. So um, this is my message to all of you. And I'm gonna give me, and this is, this is my message from me to you. And I'm telling myself a message too, saying, let self-doubt go. Let it run through you and just release it. And just go right ahead and do what you love. And that's it. Alright. If you guys want to let you know talk. Leave a couple likes. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. And you know. Like always be on me. To unleash it. No matter what. Because the beast is never sleeping. Peace.